up? What's going on? Um, checking in with y'all. I am on the way to work. Today is my last day of work for a while. Because I'm having surgery tomorrow. So, it's a little bittersweet. I love what I do. I have a great passion for what I do. I enjoy it. Um, it's cool to make coins doing something that you love. It's my passion. It's my everything. I love doing hair. So my prayer is that this surgery goes well and I can come back and do it even better than I was before to be better. Hey y'all, how y'all, how are y'all? So, um, today we are down to the wire. Tomorrow is surgery day. I just left work. I just packed up my entire workstation. And uh, I left work and um, I'm on the way to my house to go um, pack my bag and uh, basically kind of move in over at my parents' house for the next month or so. Um, I do need to wash my car. Um, I'm just going to wash my hair when I get over there. Because that way I'm going to take everything with me anyway. Um, I can wash my hair and stuff over there. Um, I need to go to a grocery store to get like toiletries like um, freaking uh, soap and stuff. Not soap. Um, Ah, to get like freezer bags and stuff to put my toiletries in. That's what I need to do. Uh, what else do I need? And just straightening up my apartment, really. That's really it. Uh, vacuuming, vacuuming, wiping down, uh, getting paper and stuff up that I need to clean up. So I've got a lot to do. And then after I do all that and get to my parents' house, I still have to do my youngest hair. So yeah, I got two strands with this hair and it's already four o'clock. Uh, the nails are gone. Bye bye nails. Bye bye nails. Um, so that's sad. Uh, my nails are gone. Uh, it's kind of depressing. Um, uh, but it is what it is. Um, what else? The nails are gone. I packed up my station. I got my stuff in my car. I really need to get some ice water. I need some water. I'm thirsty. I need something cold to drink. And that's really it. I think what I'm going to do, I have these spaghetti straps uh, maxi dresses. I have like six of them. I'm going to pack all six of those. Um, I'm going to pack my little pajamas that I have. Yeah. That's really it. I'm not going to wash clothes because it's going to take too long. Whatever I need to wash, I just wash it at my mother's house. I'm not going to worry about it. But I am going to stop by Walmart and probably pick up a couple of moo's and some um, just little stuff here and there. Socks, things like that. Alright, y'all. I just want to check in and say hey say what's up and uh let you know how my day was going while i prep for surgery tomorrow what's up youtube it's been a really long day if you hear the snoring in the background that would be Delilah. <laughs> he wanted to sleep with me one last night we are staying at my parents house uh for now um but yeah um i am about to take it in because I have surgery and uh, I have to be there at 6 surgery starts at 8 so I'm about to go to work it's my last day of surgery hey y'all I told y'all I would take y'all on this journey with me so I'm sitting here with my dryer drying my locks just washed with the Dow soap. You see it back there. Um, uh, this one that I can't wear any deodorant. The only thing
thing I can put on is moisturizer for my face. My eyes are red and puffy because I haven't really slept. But I told y'all I'm going to take y'all with me. So, this is my surgery outfit. My little t-shirt. So here we go. I am checked in and just waiting to go back. I'm waiting on um, my brother to get up here. And I'll check back in with y'all when I got something else going on. Alright y'all, so I got my gown on. I got my little bracelet or whatever. Um my hair is crazy because y'all know like I said I washed it this morning but um at least it's clean before I'm going down for surgery all my jewelry is out I feel so naked my nose ring my lip ring from ring my earrings everything's out um basically just waiting for the anesthesiologist to come talk to me so yeah um they got a compression thingamajigger on one foot and my other foot is bare my right foot that they're going to operate on. So, yeah, I'll just keep going. I'll see y'all in a minute. Hey, y'all. I know I look like a demented Pillsbury Doughboy with this on my head. <laughs> so, I'm just... There's my foot that's wrapped up. That's my foot that's got the top on it. So, that's my foot up under there. <clears throat> I just came out of anesthesia. Dang, I'm going to put this thing tight around my head. So I just came out of anesthesia. I made some graham crackers and some ginger ale. I'm on a heavy dose of pain medication. Um, I feel good for the most part. My side is hurting where they extract the bone marrow that's what been hurt the most other than that i'm good i'm still alive <laughs> yeah god is good so yeah we're here hey y'all what's up i am on the way back to my parents house i'm gonna get dressed for my up y'all so i'm in the ride uh made it to my parents house let me show you so that's my foot up under all that that's my other foot so cool i don't really feel my foot excuse my face is swollen i always swell up after surgery i don't feel my foot um at all They put a pain blocker to make my foot numb. I can't put any weight on it. So my brother went to get my crutches. Mostly right now, I'm just itching, y'all. Um, some of the medicine is starting to wear off. Wear off. So I'm just itching. But other than that, everything's going well. I just want to check in with y'all and say, hey, what's up? How you doing? Before I go into another stupor. <laughs> Truth be told, um, as a giraffe, so am I. If you know, you know. Uh, <laughs> but this is not from my own medicinal. This is from Dr. Christophilus. So they gave me some morphine. I still got a little anesthesia in my system. And then they gave me some Benadryl for the itching. So yeah, y'all, um, this is my spot where I had my IV. Oh, I'm just out of it. <laughs> y'all probably gonna be laughing. 
Y'all, I've been laughing for like 20 minutes straight. I don't know what is so funny because actually my ribs where they did the bone marrow, it hurts so bad. I keep getting laughing, bro. Anyway, got some Wendy's. I got a grilled chicken wrap and some fries and a Coke Zero. And that's it. Um, so still trying to stay on my health, whatever. I mean, Wendy's ain't the best, but I just want to put something in my stomach now before I take more pain medication. Y'all just say a prayer. Thank you for your continued prayers. Um, I'll talk to y'all later. Okay, so update y'all. I am getting here with this machine right here. So there's the compressor machine. It goes up there. And my foot is about to meet the compressor machine. So it can compress and keep me from having blood clots. You know how everybody say that they go to like the surgery centers and whatever and they get their body done. I'm at my mama's house. It's the best surgery center that ever. <laughs> recovery house. <laughs> you can't recover like you can nowhere else but your mom and daddy house. So I'm with my family and they've been taking care of me and doing an amazing, amazing job. All right, y'all. This pain is about to kick in, and it's my time for my pain medicine. So I'm finna try and catch a nap until it is. Hey y'all, what's up? Thanks for checking in again. Just gonna get to my sleeping shirt and just go ahead and get this sleeping shirt. Finish me. Oops, my compression machine is right there. I'm about to eat, and they gave me Percocets. I still don't have any feeling. In my leg all the way up to my knee um but i'm about to eat a little meal and take one of my percocets before everything kicks in because it's real this is probably the hardest recovery so far that i've ever had to do hopefully tomorrow will be better but i just want to check in with y'all and say hey so yeah what's up y'all this is uh my second full day since surgery so I had surgery Tuesday um rested yesterday Wednesday and rested again today on Thursday um let me show you what I got for breakfast my mom made me some eggs strawberries so they're a little juicy and I got some water in my cup And if you're wondering why my voice sounds like this, when they put the tube down my throat, <clears throat> it, I don't know, aggravated my throat. So, that's why I sound the way I sound, like how I sound on the phone. But I'm about to eat something, and I'll talk to y'all later. <clears throat> hey, y'all, how y'all, how y'all? Yeah, my face is still swollen. Show you what I'm eating for lunch. Veggie pasta salad, spaghetti, and some water. Put some crackers in there. Here it is, y'all. Here it is. Chicken wings. Here it is, y'all. So I just want to check in, let y'all know what's going on. I'll get back with y'all later. Hey, y'all. Just checking in. I know it's dim in here. It's cloudy outside. I don't have the lights on, but um, sorry, it seems like I'm always in the bed when I'm talking to y'all, but the locks are, they're doing their own thing right now, and they're breaking, that's my compression machine that we have redo my shit, I used to do this five times a day for 30 minutes a day, and it kind of sucks, um, this leg is healing, I don't know if y'all can see it, that has been bruised that has grown a tail earlier this week or last week and so that is a good bruise 
Let you know I am not good with the crutches at all. So I'm trying not to really use them. Anyway, I just wanted to check in with y'all and give y'all and talk to y'all later. Hey y'all, what's up? I know this isn't the most um, aesthetically pleasing uh, view of me, but here we are. Um, <laughs> I am recovering from surgery, so yeah. Here's the current situation. Um, I do have more material. There are some crutches. There is another set of crutches. And there is a book. A book. Um, yeah, so current situation. Um, it is hard to um, get around. My face is breaking out all over the place you can even see my breakouts in the dark that's sad but it's real um mentally honestly i'm just existing um nothing's really going on i'm just existing uh i actually had a moment where i almost thought about brushing out my locks yesterday that's about my mental state yeah i grabbed a brush and i, I started brushing at this lock right here Y'all see that? I had thought of brushing out my locks, y'all. Which I don't think would be a good idea because I have very soft hair and it's going to break anyway. If I do all that pulling to it, mm, I'm not going to brush them out. I'm just going to leave them. So, that's where I was and I wanted to be honest and posting my updates on what is going on. So, if I look ashy and disastery, it is what it is. This is my real life. And this is a real vlog. Um, my days are not that interesting right now because I'm laid up. So it is what it is. Um, but I just wanted to come to y'all and say hey and check in. Let me know what y'all got going on.